Viking Creek's water. Drain in the Viking Creek's water. Hello, good morning, and welcome back to another vlog. I am off to have some brunch breakfast with some friends that are in town. You guys just got to see Sarah a couple. Mercy! Marty is screaming at me this morning. You guys just got to see Sarah in the Miami vlog, but she is from Nashville, so she's in town. And then her childhood bestie, which has also become one of my best friends over the last 10 years, is in town from Florence. Myrtle wants me to shut up, but we all are reunited back in Nashville this weekend and we're gonna spend some quality time together. You guys actually went to Alexis's wedding with me. I love her so much. It's so crazy to me now that she lives in Florence and her husband's from Florence. So it's just, we used to live in Florence if you're new here. So it's just a crazy, the world is so small. It really is. And it is just so, y'all know, it's important to get that girl time in. Luna had a small procedure done this past week. She had a growth. Trying not to freak myself out, so we were just being calm about it. Um, but she just had a small growth removed. She's doing good, she's feeling better. There's just not a lot of inflammation happening. So it's like she's healing pretty nicely and they're all like internal stitching and stuff. So they don't have to go back for um, to get anything out. She's, she's looking good, so. Mercy started going to town over there, so I moved us over here. <laughs> but I actually started this vlog yesterday, and when I picked up the camera, when I got to where I was going, memory card was still at home. So I was still able to get some phone clips. We went to, you know, one of our favorite places, 60 Vines. So I will show you those clips, and then I will meet you at breakfast. One thing about me, I'm gonna get the burger, and so are all of my friends. We all, <laughs> all have burgers. She 
So what about me? What about me? Mm -mm. <laughs> what about me, Annika? You're whacking the heck out of Weasley back here. The getting unready process is really becoming one of my favorite times of day, okay? I bring my iPad in my bathroom now. I will spend, I'll watch a whole episode of something while I am scrubbing and moisturizing my body. Here's a little secret for you. Yep, you guessed it. Us long-haired girlies wear the ponytail extensions too. Listen, there's something about just having more hair to work with on days especially that I don't want to do anything with my hair. They are so nice. I got this one from Amazon. Can't recommend it enough. I got changed into my new favorite Skims pajamas. I've been wanting this set for a while and they really are worth the hype. I love them. Next up, we are moving on to what I'm now liking to call intuitive skincare. I heard the Gals on the Go podcast call it this a couple weeks ago and I was like, that is exactly what I've been doing. You know when you can just tell what night your face needs what? Something I do need every night, however, is this homemade lash and brow serum that I love. It's just castor oil and vitamin E oil. Speaking of castor oil, we love a castor oil pack around here. They really have like changed my life. And then we top it all off with some red light therapy and I really love to disassociate during this part. Okay, and I did brush my teeth. I don't know where those clips went you're just gonna have to trust me love ya good night how fun was that we had such a cute day i got home and honestly you guys i intended on working for like a few hours and being done but my laptop has finally given out which is something that i've struggled with for like over a year now i've tried to like i mean just like when you spend so much money on a product and you know it's only gonna last you four or five years and then when that four or five years comes along it's just still devastating it's still devastating but my computer is just no longer running how it needs to be with what I use to edit and so it's taking me not even double like probably triple or quadruple time to edit so I like it's been taking me so much longer to get things done and things have gotten behind and so finally I just bit the bullet I ordered a new MacBook she's gonna get me in in about a week and I'm trying to debate on just like kind of pausing and I guess you guys will know at this point what I've done but I, I almost want to just like hold up and I'd rather be behind schedule a couple days and then be able to like really be excited about working and crank it out versus like I get so frustrated because it's just basically the, the circle of death if you've got a Mac you know it just gets to a point where it start I click one thing and then that little rainbow circle this guy right here pops up and just spins and spins and spins and spins and then I click to another tab and I'm like well I'll start doing this while I'm doing that and then I forget and I come back and I click one more time and then it's another 30 minutes like it's genuinely taking years off my life so we got that done it is now Saturday morning Drake is in town with his girlfriend so we're gonna be able to see them tonight but we're starting off at breakfast this morning at two below honey in franklin i've only been here a couple other times um once with reagan and i liked it it's just like not on my side of town so i never come over here I know I went to brunch yesterday and today, two days in a row. But it's my brunch cruise in town. My girlfriends are in town, so. Okay, what are you doing today? I am, oh, I'm actually vlogging right now. Say hello. Okay. Hi. <laughs> Girl, look at her smiles this morning. Good morning. Hey, give her a high five. <laughs> high five. Sorry, I just woke up. It's only like a 15 minute nap. <laughs> Good news, we have decided to ignore all of the laundry and responsibilities that I need to do today. And we're actually gonna go on a walk. It's just too pretty outside. And Lynn is feeling so good. And Weasley's wanting to get outside. Like we're just, we, we need to go outside. So we're going outside.
And just like that, we're back. We are ready for dinner tonight. I'm gonna go meet AJ at work and we're gonna drive to Nashville together. We're gonna meet Drake and his girlfriend at One Kitchen. You know, we love the One Kitchen. And I just, I might get a candle or something. No, I make my own candles now. And you know, every now and then I just need to walk into the one and just smell it, you know? Ignore my, ignore my suction cup <laughs> spots on my mirror. But my hat is from Brandy Melville. I got it from Brandy Melville in LA, actually. And it says Nashville. It's the perfect brown color. And then this is my Essentials hoodie that I freaking love. I got it from PacSun. It's linked in my shop my. My Abercrombie jeans, I do not remember which ones these are called. I am always a curve love gal, but I don't exactly remember which style these are. They are definitely linked on my shop my though as well. And then my Birkenstocks featuring my hair. Hello. AJ's is bigger, or mine's bigger. We're gonna do a switcheroo. I had a long day at work, okay? <laughs> toodaloo, Bye. toodaloo. Bye. We're gonna be dry. neighbors soon. We're gonna be soon. We're gonna be neighbors. Okay, love okay. you guys. I love you. That way and down one, or this way and down one? Yeah. Either way. <laughs> love you. <laughs> that was wonderful. So fun. So fun. It was so good to see. What's the beat? Hello. Of course. We love her. Love We're her. obsessed with her. Love her. We love I her. I can't to live here. I know, that's going to be so fun. Oh, how? How fun. We actually oh, always made it. Come 16. Oh, that's so fun. This is really cute. Yeah, this is really Wait, what is this? Hand cut. Fun. Oh, it looks God, really. Oh, yeah, we really have been meaning to come to this. Fun. Okay, sold 11 dresses at work today. 11. That's kind of crazy. Sorry, it's, it's just a little shaky. These roads, these Nashville it's roads. The Nashville main road. I mean, they there's a pothole city here. <gasps> look how beautiful. It's so pretty. Oh, look how beautiful. I have wanted to go to Union Station for forever. That's Union Station. How beautiful. We've got to go before we leave. Oh, it's so pretty. Scooter people need to work with their <laughs> God, I think I'm going to handle one of them every time. Do you want to scooter? No. Five no. points for Gryffindor. No. <laughs> when did that hotel get here? I've never, or I guess it's, it might be Condos. That's where Whis Whiskey Kitchen was actually. This is Nashville. This is, it's just Nashville. <laughs> Every time you drive around something, a new building's here. Oh, that's this lovely. is, that's crazy actually. Sunday. Here's what I've been up to. 
this huge mound, this mound of AJ's clothes have been folded for the last like hour. Yeah, and you're saying that right. There's a whole another mound over there that we're not done with. We've not even, we've not even gotten to that just yet. So we are changing out our closets. AJ went through her closet a couple of days ago. And so I'm helping her get her winter stuff packed up and hopefully we will not be unpacking these items. We won't be unpacking these items until we live in another state. So we really need to like get them packed up good and nice. I don't want to have to like rewash things. I don't, I want to pack them up so they don't potentially smell like storage. You know, sometimes things can smell like storage. So we are getting this taken care of. I just stopped and had some lunch. I had a factor and I also made my Sunday sourdough loaf. I feel like I've been like making or prepping on Sunday and Monday. Those have been my like sourdough days. So I was able to make a loaf this morning and it turned out so good. I just had a in slice. I put some garlic butter on it and ate it with my factor. So it was really good. Now I think I'm going to get started on this chair. I've got a lot of my stuff that also needs to go. I do have some of mine placed into the bags. I don't have them vacuum sealed yet, but we also have lots of laundry that we're taking care of today too. So this is really just a, oh, and we're not even gonna, we got some dishes we gotta work on too. So we've really just been having the most Sunday, Sunday. And this is the Sunday fit. We're just in some lounge clothes. We've got Toons feeling great still. She's taking her meds. She's finishing it up. I think in two more days, we'll be officially done with all of her like pain and inflammation medicines. So we're doing good. There's some laundry over here that needs to actually go over here. All right. Look at this baby girl. She really is beautiful. Let's see her from this side. Oh yeah. A little flat, but she's very good. Welcome home. So did you see why I said that we're going to be, it's going to be a team effort to put them in the bags because I, since I folded them. It's not that bad. Jane. This is going to be the This size. is a queen bed and it's completely like it's. going to be the size of my New York farm. I know. I don't know what we're going to do. I don't, I don't, I've been thinking about, I mean, storage is not good. We're going to have to do like spring, summer, fall, winter closets, not just spring, I summer, can't. fall. Winter. I can't, like, all my stuff I know. On. We're going to have to just figure out different, and we don't know what our apartment's going to look like, but we're just going to have to figure out storage stuff. And as soon as it's in the storage, I'm going to say, I want it. I want it. I know, I know. It'll be okay. I'm going to go to the sauna <laughs> really quick. Okay, perfect. I really am going to get started on that chair first. I've done a couple of other things. I've done everything oh. actually else. That's only a couple of your winter jackets, but that's a lot of my stuff that I've got to like try on and stuff. If you get together the skims returns, I'll take them. of the clothes as I could but they're not all put up yet they're not we still got some bags however I did do a Walmart pickup order it was just one of the Walmart times of grocery shopping you know we just needed some stuff and um, I was hungry 
And I was not supervising. And Annika was not watching me. So I did just get whatever, you know, felt right to me. Okay. And so there are some treats in here and some things that we just love. For some reason, this cereal, it is so good. It's just so good. It's, yeah, I guess it was my like childhood cereal. So that's like the one that I love. But every now and then I just need it. Didn't necessarily need the family size, but. So I didn't get myself cereal without getting you your cereal. Well, I like that cereal too. I know, you like that cereal too, but I was just like, you know, it's, it's just been, I've been craving bowls of cereal lately. So I also am gonna make some Rice Krispie treats, the um, little like actual marshmallow okay. treats. So got some of those. We're a two bag of tortilla chips household. Like you can't get, even though they're, <laughs> yeah, put your hand in the bacon grease folder. Drain them and making grease water. If we've got salsa, any sort of, I mean, even we'll eat them plain. Like it, we need two bags. They'll be gone in one sitting. Okay, this is a treat bag. This is a treat bag. <laughs> we'll start with the worst of the worst. I would say this is worse than this. Really? Yes. Yeah. It was either five or sixty, and well, I was I like two fives. Oh yeah, I guess I could have done that. I was just craving airheads. Let's have one. I don't want one. Okay, yeah, let's not really get one. Okay, so we got some airheads. I heads. never like airheads. You don't? No. Oh, okay. It was well, the texture is, thing. The texture's great. You get to kind of enjoy it and, and kind of taffy it, you know? I remember you loving them, though, when I was a kid. This was my, like, softball gas snack in my yeah, gas, gas station. station. Yeah, I loved this. A little... Perfect. What you doing? Right, see? This is definitely second worst. This is probably tied with... I know that there's not one good thing for me in these right here, but you know what is good? The in there? Serotonin. <laughs> these? I, I can... Are so... Good. Is this the superior Pop-Tart flavor? 100%. Yeah. This is the superior Pop-Tart flavor. And at this point, I think we can say it is like an OG. Yeah, it's not strawberry or whatever, but it's... It's an OG. It's OG. Like, it's been here since My I... My whole life. Like, okay. Reagan put in our little bachelorette things, the Nature Valley Crunch Bars, and I never get them because they're such a mess to eat, and I was eating it, and I was like, this is the best thing ever. It was such a good snack. So, I got us the chocolate oats, oats and dark chocolate. And I, we're traveling soon, so I figured we could have some bars coming up, and we like to keep these in our cars and purses and things. These, they have wafers! And Annika has been on a peanut butter kick, so I got us these like wafer ones to try as well. Nice. Fun, huh? Love a good box top. Okay, now this was supposed to be one tiny square box Kleenex. of Kleenex. So, but it is like allergy season. We've never tried the true lemon. We, we, I keep the true limes on hand. So basically it's just like crystallized lemon and lime. This one is lemon, obviously. And I love putting lemon in my water and I love, and I don't want to have to keep cutting up a whole lemon all the time. So those are just nice to have, hopefully. Here's my marshmallows for my treats. I also got some more baking chips. I've got some dark chocolate ones for you this time. And then just some regular. Annika is a dark chocolate girl. I'm Always. more of a milk chocolate. The, I just got recently these. Yeah, I love those. I'll use those in our cookies. They're um, Ghirardelli premium baking non-dairy dark chocolate chips. And they're really good. They're really good. They're really good. I really like them. So I'm looking for an alternative. Okay, this is a combination of us and the animals. We'll probably have two of these, and the animals will probably have six. But we love tuna and water. Speaking of animals, if you have cats, this is a must. This is a must. You sprinkle it in their litter. Now, it, it's nice for ours because we sprinkle it in there, and then it gets, like, rotated okay. in. Or as it comes, like, rotating back, we'll sprinkle some in. If you scoop your litter, do it and just kind of, like, mix it through. But essentially, the baking soda of it all helps it absorb. So, and it just makes it smell a little bit better. Food. Food. That's not her go-to, but she was needing cans, and so we just went with that. I got this when I made my Thanksgiving meal, like at the beginning of the year, and I loved it. So I was like, we don't have to do like a whole Thanksgiving turkey of it all, but it did like turkey and mashed potatoes or something one night, and green beans, and <laughs> maybe some dressing. Got you some. Oh, that's not. Well, I meant. But you can take them to Glamour if you don't like them. Okay. I did get you these, and I know you will like this. Though. Oh my god. Yeah, this is my gas station snack. And then I got me. It's time, y'all. I just got it you is these. No, you got me the, um, not the cream ones. No, you just, this, these. They look like they're like, what is it? Incubating. They're like in a little carton. Cadbury cream eggs. I saw someone make a freaking hot chocolate with oh, those. You're all those. about all your different flavors hot of chocolate. hot chocolate. Lucky Charms hot chocolate. Oh. Okay. What we got in there? We have my Kerrygold! Butter. 
and more butter for I'm assuming bread. Yeah, and, and just baking and stuff. Okay, so we love this queso. This is a good one. Ponchos. Okay, y'all, the chocolate. I think this one's dark chocolate. Oh, this is chocolate protein. Oh, well, regardless. The chocolate almond milk from Silk is so good. They have like little tiny ones too. Oh, and then also we got some more almond milk. Okay, got a little. I thought this was the matcha at first. Oh, that would be nice though. Yeah. That would be nice. And then two of these guys. One for each of our rooms, I figured. We've got one in here. Parm. Even your parm. Parm. Have to have parm on hand. And then some salsa. It's not my farmer's market salsa, but I'll it's take market it. Marketplace, market side. Y'all know me. I'm a sourdough queen, and King Arthur is our guy right here. We love him. Okay, I got us some of these just to either have, and we can even take them with us traveling if we need to. But. We love snacking on these for lunch. These are really good. I mean, obviously you do like sneak up your whole office or lunchroom or whatever, oh, but like so I, I can tell people to just get over it. I'm in the break. I'm in the kitchen and eating it. It's fine. It's so good. And it really is good. It has to have everything that you need. It has mayo. It has relish. It has crackers. It has everything. Yeah. And then I got some ramen. I think I got two cups of ramen, but I love this brand specifically. And then I got us some ranch. We were out of ranch. Next up. We have some brown sugar, and I just used the last of our brown sugar. Some cleaning stuff. We got some dishwashing pods. I was thinking we were running low on those. Yeah. Some more. We just ran out of this. This is my favorite stain remover. It just works, and if it don't broke, don't works. fix it. What did you need the drain up for? Um, I think it's the hairs in my sink. Um, my bathroom sink. Yeah. Okay, I got two different kinds of chicken nuggets for AJ to try. I'm really kind of excited about these. These we have tried before, oh, and she does let love. Let me tell you why I love my frozen chicken nuggets. Well, who doesn't freaking love frozen chicken nuggets? Well, it's listen, the best thing to have in the fridge. I work all day. I get up, I go to the gym. And I work I like a dog, all day. day. All day. <laughs> and I work like a dog, day and night. And I come home and I want to eat something good, but I don't want to cook. Or I want to go through a drive-thru. Girl, you don't have to explain so, yourself. Chicken nuggets frozen, is a way of life. Like, I'm We have those, those, right? I don't think so. I feel like we have. We've had the ones from Costco. I feel like that's just... Okay, okay. Well, then these get Chick-fil-A to me, so I thought you could try those. They were really highly rated on them. So, we got two different ones of those, and then I also got you some... Idaho potatoes. All right, these are the extra crispy fast food fries. Sure. So those are nice. Thanks, Idaho. And lastly, now I will say, normally I'm a minis gal, and then I was like, no, I'll just be a 12 pack gal. I and I really, with my whole heart, thought that this. Now this is not a problem, but I thought this was gonna be a 12 pack. That's a 12 pack. Okay. Okay. That rounds our grocery trip up. I will say. We did vlog a day. We, we've we having some computer issues. You'll, you'll hear about that next vlog, but we did vlog a, a full day, okay? And we did not include it. It was a 10 minute vlog because we have also been missing from YouTube um, for a minute. If you've not been keeping up with me on Instagram, we've had some computer issues. So I so very much apologize, but we do have a 10 minute vlog on TikTok. If you have not seen it, you can go get some more of us there. Otherwise, I'm also back in full swing. I took, yeah. I took some time off unintentionally and now I'm back in full swing. Yeah, I got three vlogs not posted. I'll probably film in Florence. Like, yeah, we got a good. lot. We got I a got lot, a lot coming up. Spring is springing over so here. So much coming up. Thank you so much for watching this video, and we will see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.